This chapter is called The Power of Doing the Right Thing. The reason why I love and I'm really happy to be able to introduce this chapter to you is because I don't think doing the right thing has anything to do with professional ethics or values or what have you. I think doing the right thing is a personal mindset. And quite frankly, in my family, we have a motto. And my 10-year-old and my 6-year-old know that they need to maintain the motto of do the right thing all the time. Uh, it doesn't mean that you're not going to be challenged. It doesn't mean that you're uh, not going to your, your ethics and values uh, are are not going to be uh, at times violated. However, it does mean that you need to choose the right path all the time. From that standpoint, let me give you a few examples in, uh, of what I mean. Um, from our standpoint here at Greater Media, we have very high expectations of our employees. We have expectations of what they do internally and externally. We have expectations that they work as a team. We, we have expectations that they're honest. We have expectations that they're committed to um, developing themselves and developing their clients. We also expect that they do it with the right mindset. We expect that when they're selling something, that they sell it the right way and that they're not selling it to make a sale today, but they're trying to create a customer for life, a customer that's going to believe and trust in them, that they have credibility. Because in sales, it's not about getting the sale. It's about developing a raving fan, a fan about, of you as well as the organization you work for. And at times, you'll find that customers challenge your ethics and your values as well. Sometimes they might ask you to backdate an invoice, or they might ask you to do something that isn't quite ethical and that's when you truly get challenged. I'll tell you, those times have happened in my career and I've always chosen the right path. And today as I stand before you as a Vice President of Sales, it's not because I took the easy way, it's because I took the right way. And so from that standpoint, you need to consider when you're challenged with a tough decision of going the right or the wrong way, you need to make the right decision. It will always pay off. Short term, it might not feel like the right thing to do, but long term, it's the right thing. It'll help you, it'll help your customer, and it'll help the organization. And I guarantee what will happen from there is that your business will grow exponentially. So you can sell something today, and maybe you get 10% more in income today. But if you develop a fan for life, you'll grow your income, you'll grow uh, your successful career by 10 times. You want 10% today or you want 10 times in the future? So think about it. Next time you're ready to make a tough decision, make the right one. Your career as well will grow by 10 times.